As we all know, iOS 26 has some eye-catching upgrades. The liquid glass design offers a more transparent look, and the lock screen can smartly adjust the time display size. There are also new features like AI-powered automatic call answering and real-time translation. However, the iOS 26 beta version is far from perfect. Many users have reported issues such as system lag, app crashes, and rapid battery drain. It leads everyone who updates to iOS 26 to want to go back to the previous system version. If you're one of those regretting the upgrade, don't worry. In today's video, I will show you step-by-step -step how to safely downgrade iOS 26 to iOS 18 without losing any data. Let's take the iPhone 13 as an example to show it. Step 1. Turn off Find My iPhone. First of all, go to Settings and access your Apple account. Next, find the Find My iPhone option and turn it off. This is important to avoid any issues during the backup and downgrade process and to prevent activation lock afterwards. Step 2. Backup your data. If you have iCloud Plus, you can do a full backup on iCloud. Then you can restore your data directly from iCloud after the downgrade. If you don't have that much iCloud space, it's recommended to use iTunes to backup your data. Simply connect your device to your computer, and iTunes will pop up. Then go to the summary page and click Backup Now to create a local backup. Step 3. Downgrade iOS 26 to iOS 18. If you want to downgrade iOS easily with one click, this iOS downgrade tool, AnyFix, is one you can't miss. It supports downgrading iOS 26 to iOS 18 in one click, simply, safely, and trustworthily. Besides, AnyFix is designed to fix over 150 Apple issues with one click, and can resolve any system problems from iOS 26 beta upgrades. Next, let me show you how to downgrade iOS 26 to iOS 18 without losing any data. First, connect your iPhone to the computer via a USB cable and open the AnyFix application. So you can see the page and click the upgrade slash downgrade iOS option. After entering, we click the downgrade. And then, we can see the iOS 18 firmware and click this to download. After the download is completed, click download here. Note that downgrading will erase your phone data, but we can restore it from the previous backup. Finally, after waiting for the device to turn on, you will find that you have downgraded iOS 26 to iOS 18 successfully. Additionally, if you want to learn how to downgrade using an IPSW file, we'll show you the steps, but please note, we're not responsible for its safety or stability. Visit the Epsu. Me website to locate the iOS files you want for your iPhone model. Then download the file and wait for the process to complete. After this, return to iTunes or Finder. Then hold the Shift key, click on Restore iPhone, and select the IPSW file you downloaded. Confirm the restoration, and your iPhone will downgrade to the version you downloaded. After the downgrade, your phone is back to factory settings. Step 4. Restore backup data. Now we can go back to iTunes and start the restore process. However, because you backed up your data with iTunes while you were using iOS 26 beta, and now your phone is back to iOS 18, some modifications are necessary. First, hold down the Win Plus or keys to open the Run dialog box and type percent app data percent percent. Then go to Apple Mobile Sync and open the backup folder. The backup we created should be the most recent one based on the last modified time. Inside the folder, scroll down to the bottom and find the info. Open it in Notepad. Press Ctrl plus F to open the search bar and search for the word product. Not too far down, you'll see the product version. If you downgraded from iOS 26 beta, it should say 26. Change it into the version you downgraded to. Lastly, tap Ctrl and S to save the file. Now we can go back to iTunes and start the restore process. Let's click on Restore Backup and select the backup we just modified. After your iPhone has restarted, you'll find that all of your phone's data is back. Hope you can solve the issue by following the method provided in this video. If you like it, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Feel free to leave a comment below. See you next time.